Hey guys, this video is about someone I find utterly repulsive online. I don't know how, but this guy somehow wound up with a wife. And of course he's like nine years older than her, which makes him a total pedophile. Like to me, that's sick. You should never marry someone who's more than two years younger or older than you. Why are people so disgusting? Like seriously, why don't they just find someone their own age? On top of that, this guy demonizes his haters. Like when anybody says anything that conflicts with him, he automatically says, oh, block and delete your message and send are you? Like who does that? A coward. A coward does that. Somebody who's afraid of the truth. Somebody who doesn't want your opinion. Why would you get on the internet if you don't want to accept criticism? You have to be a total loser, a coward, a scumbag to delete comments, to block people, to censor comments only allowing people who support you to have an opinion. You know who does that? Hitler. Hitler does that. It just disturbs me to a great degree that people like this are literally shopping with me. Like they, they could be at Safeway buying peanut butter when I'm buying cereal and I, I almost made contact with them. I would rather have someone who pickpockets people walk near me than somebody who, who filters comments. They're a socialist, communist, dirtbag. And on top of this, this guy's ex-wife stole from him. Like she took a bunch of his stuff and he had the nerve to make a public video saying, she stole from me and she's pursuing me for $150,000. Like, why do you need to make it public? If you're so concerned, then handle it off camera. The internet isn't for trashing people. The internet is for heroes like me to go out and attack people who are attacking people. You can go check out his channel, Onision, and leave a bunch of hate comments. If you want to subscribe to him, go ahead and subscribe to him just so you can hate on every single video that he makes. There's just so much crap on this guy that I could just go on forever. Like, he makes fun of people who cut themselves. He makes fun of people who drink. He makes fun of people who are fat. He makes fun of people who have depression. I, he says Family Guy does that, but that's just a cop-out. Family Guy is a good television show. He's an online entertainer. Big difference between the two. Family Guy can say things that he can't because Family Guy is actually funny. You can only say extremely offensive things about people who self-harm, people who are fat, people who are extremely depressed if you're funny. You know what? Never mind. Family Guy is a horrible show and he's a horrible person too. There. Now no one can joke about depression or anything like that. It's, it's black and white. That's how I like to view the world. He makes videos where he says he hates meat eaters. He makes videos where he literally attacks people who circumcise their children. Like really guys, if you support this man, you're, you're probably a stupid 13 year old. You really are. You're probably a total idiot because 99% of his viewers are like 10 years old. You know what it is? It's all part of his cult. He is. He wrote it. And if you've actually read it, it says a bunch of horrible things. Like, well, it, it says, it says a bunch of weird things. It, I don't even need to say them. It, it's just weird. Oh, and he cheats on women. I, uh, he's made a bunch of videos about how he doesn't cheat, but that's what people do when they cheat. Onision is a piece of garbage. Now you know, and I feel better about myself. I can go um, in the bathroom and make love to my hand confidently knowing that I am a bigger man than Onision. Thank you for watching. Fight the, fight the evil. That is Onision. Bye. Oh God.